So it's now been the third week for Ho Valley opening in their new school and sadly there's been an incident involving two students and a car outside the school trying to cross the road. The crossing doesn't appear to be fit for purpose. It's missing lights and the timings are totally wrong. I'm going to give an example crossing the road to see how long it takes for one person and how well the lights are timed. Maybe this button works. If you're on that side, you... No. No, it's gone again. Third time lucky. lights to go out because there's no sign at all there. So on this side of the road, this is the only indication that you can cross. There we go. And gone. So that side only just made it. Cars are going straight away. Let's try this side again. Again, no light to look at. Single button there. One, two, three, four, five, oh no, it's red. It's red before I even got to the other side. But how are the kids supposed to see that while they're crossing? And the cars are going ready. Try going back. No, I want to cross please. Cross, please. Okay. One, two, three, and it's red. <laughs> that is ridiculous, and the cars are moving already. So it's not even giving one person enough time to get from one side to the other safely 
and that's if you notice the light turn green straight away because there's no audi audible noise to warn anyone. I'm honestly in shock that someone at Surrey County Council would have signed off on this as safe and fit for purpose. I call on everyone in the area to give them as much stick as possible to get this sorted out quickly because kids are using this every day, at least twice a day. Uh, we've already had one incident that should never have happened. We don't want any more. For goodness sake, we don't want any more. Make it safe, sorry. Do it now.